The executive director of the Economic and Organized Crime Office, Mamitiwa Adodankwa, is making a strong push to prioritize the safety of children online. It comes on the back of increasing cases of missing children, sometimes related to the activities online. There's more in this report. Missing Children Ghana has marked the International Missing Children's Day, which is observed to raise awareness about the plight of missing children over the world and honor the efforts made to reunite families and protect vulnerable children. Currently, since we started in May 2021, we have received over 700 police reports of missing children, as in the police extracts from families that came to us. With this report, together with our team, we have been able to reunite 300 of these cases from 2021 to 2024. You can imagine those that we still not reunited. Today, a man came here. His son has been missing from, since 2018. They are in trauma looking for the child. It is real. The issue of missing children is real. And the event brought together families, schools, communities, and stakeholders to advocate for stronger measures to prevent child disappearances. Speaking at the event, Executive Director of Yoko, COP Mamiya Tiwa Dankwa, urged parents to take immediate action to protect their children from the devastating effects of online bullying and harassment. And train them how to be secured online. Not only the school children, but everybody. How you can monitor your children when they go online, how they can identify suspected person who has bad motive. So this is something that we want to do to also push the agenda against um, people getting messy because if they know certain things that they have to be wary of, when especially when they are online, it will go a long way to help them to avoid certain sites and avoid talking to certain people and also, even when they have their own device, what they have to do and how and when to report any suspicious action of anybody, either to the parent and for the parent to also report to law enforcement agents. So that is what we want to support this project. I'm so passionate about it because I know how it feels when your child gets missing and you don't know whether the person will come back or it's not come back. Meanwhile, the founder of Missing Children Ghana, Regina Samoa, used the occasion to launch Safety of Children project aimed at intensifying education and sensitizing schools and communities. So as Missing Children Ghana, we joined the World to Mother's Day. Today, what we did is to be able to raise funds to support an educational project that targets five regions for now. Sorry, four regions for now. We'll be going to those four regions. That is the Greater Accra region, the Central region, the Eastern region, and the Volta region. We'll be visiting schools with our team of experts to educate children on safety measures. Here in Ghana, when a child goes missing, and fortunately, a good Samaritan finds the child, the child is taken to the police. Then the police will interrogate the child. From there, the child is handed over to social welfare. Then the, uh, social welfare will also interrogate the child. If the social welfare gets enough information, then the child is reunified. If not, the child is taken into an orphanage. The gap we have seen is that a lot of children don't know the basic details about their families and about themselves. And so we have thousands of children across Ghana in orphanages who are not orphans, but are missing children.